Welcome chat, welcome again to another live stream. <clears throat> Today we're going to be going over the new DLC for Skur Ritual. It's a brand new zombie round based map. If you have not heard of it yet, I highly recommend it. This is a brand new DLC. So we are currently... I wonder why the camera's not working. Let's give it a second here. On off. We are off here. All right, chat. Well, welcome and thank you for tuning in. If you have not yet, hit subscribe down below. Today we're going to do a quick run through to see what this new map's about. It's called House of the Boom. You get it, but it's a zombie-based game. I love this game to a comparison to Call of Duty round based it is very similar in some regards it has some variations and there's obviously not the same game but if you like round based modes this is a game that you want to heavily consider downloading they just dropped this DLC a couple of days ago so why exactly it has not gotten as much notice as it, I believe it should beyond me but we're gonna run it as high resolution as possible and see if we can give you the best quality for this because it looks like it's rendering at a pretty high rate frame rate so this is not my original account my other account is for Xbox I don't know yet exactly how I can integrate the um I don't know how I can integrate I don't know how I can integrate. What am I trying to say? Words come to me, Lord God. I don't know how I can innovate beyond what I already am doing with the Wi-Fi connection. I'm going to try to get a, like a hardwire connectivity and, you know, see if that works. But some of these games, you know, they take up a lot of uh, processing power. So that's what we're trying to prevent is lags in the stream here. And it's already, just in the menu, it's already like, hey, buddy, <laughs> we're having trouble. So let's see if we can, let's see if we can correct that before we begin. Once again, if you're new to the chat, thanks so much for joining. Appreciate y'all time. Got to be patient with this. Let's do I think it's in the performance. See, I don't want quality. I want performance. Ultra performance, obviously. So let's... Uh... I don't need any motion blur. We're going to lower some of the stuff that's like kind of unnecessary. Like We don't need super high any of that. Keep the bloom to medium. And this game has like superb quality, by the way. So if I'm not, if I'm not, if I wasn't lowering um, certain elements of this, you would see it in much higher definition. But for my sake and the quality of the stream, I'm gonna do a little bit of everything. But as you can see, if you're able to see what I'm doing, it's obviously moving much quicker now. Now, when I get playing the game. <laughs> We'll find out exactly what works because that happens. It's just like it can't handle working at a lower processing power. It would appear. It just it wants to function at the highest quality. <laughs> so we'll see if everything I did saved. I don't think it did. 
but I did press, you know, save, so it might pop back up. But once again, this game is called Skur Ritual. It's a new round-based zombies, um, you know, zombie killer game. If you like that type of content, this is for you. Also, this is a disclaimer for any younger viewers. If you are watching, this contains a lot of mature content. So please be advised if you have children in the room. We don't we don't go as far as the whole cursing goes. I try to keep all that stuff a limited, but there is a lot of a mature graphic content in this game. So I'm going to just trust in what it was. What's cool about this is you have a whole new perk system. My other account, as I was saying, to, uh, you know, kind of full circle, I I wouldn't say mastered, but I did all the achievements I could possibly do. Beat all the nightmares, got the god killer weapon. That's the wonder weapon, in case you haven't figured it out. Um, and now, with these new maps, I believe there's a new wonder weapon. There's a new map. I think it's extended. They might have even made some of the steps more challenging. But you have much more of a Easter egg-esque vibe with this, I've noticed. Am I still live? Am I still live? We're good? We're good. So thank you so much if you're tuning in. But the perk system works very much like the old Cold War system where... The more you play, the more, we'll just call them gems that you'll get. And they're different tiers. There's three tiers, you know. Uh, what, I'm not even going to try. One, two, three, four, five. There's five tiers that you can upgrade and each cost a different set amount of, uh, you know, rewards that you earn. So you do this per perk and eventually your character will be so overpowered that even when you start the game you're gonna be ready and set up so it gives you options to customize your characters um there's so many of them alan i'm missing five or six on my on my main account and i have all these unlocked uh other than the ones i haven't purchased and you can you know customize the backgrounds a little bit give yourself your own little vibe and as you can see i have some specific ones because I bought the I think I bought the extended or the deluxe edition but there's a lot of cool little things and of course I would be wrong I'll be wrong to exclude my absolute favorite Bring ones. It on. let's do this come here and let me smell you that's <laughs> a shout out to Noah right there uh, I can't believe that <laughs> he would pick some of those voice lines or they would choose them but that just it's hysterical i love it so i don't i don't even care but they even let you choose the music menu which is pretty dope so that's a rundown of how the you know main interface when you launch the game looks you didn't get the loading screen it's uh, it's just kind of like a like a screensaver with a lot of different maps featured and little, probably some hints at, at some stuff. So beyond that, they have lots of great free DLC. They have a lot of, um, like when you buy the game, you get the new maps as they're launched. This might change. It could stay the same. I don't really know how it's going to play out, but what I do know is that it's going to be actively participating alongside of the releases of these other round based modes so right now we have a huge a huge opportunity for the zombie community to come back um if you're a fan of round based first person shooter games if you're a gamer or if you just like watching streams this is for you like i said the, the content is graphic so um that is my only warning i will well, it's my second warning that i will give you and we're going to hop right into this and just see. We're going to do it always. We always start it off on normal. But we're going to see if we can figure out the steps. Without making this a long, long, long stream. So once again, thank you for joining. We're staying fueled today on Arctic Vibe Celsius. So let's get right on into it. 
I haven't actually. Let me see if my controller's set up. It is. So, I haven't actually played Screw Ritual yet on my PC. So, I'm not sure if it'll run faster or slower. Um, but, for the sake of content, I think I'll just go over it. This is a great map. Cursed Land of Laven Rock. Um, I think Abraham is the main boss in this. He is scary. A lot of this game is super accurate to the horror genre. So it's taken its its turn towards like the horror theme for almost all the lore and almost all the Easter egg steps. So there's a lot of um, you know things you would assume with the maps. You know we have Cursed Land of Laven Rock. The Ashes of Skur Hotel, fantastic Easter egg, by the way. Um, Sewers of the Dan of the Dead. We have Deadly Lovers Fortress, and these four maps, they were bangers. They were bangers. I was able to fortunately speed run them all to get the achievements on my Xbox, but <laughs> we're gonna have to co coordinate how fast my settings are for this because it's a whole new system. So today. I will uh, no longer, without further ado, House of the Danged is what we are going to jump into. My first time playing, I've never done it before, so I don't know what to expect with Easter egg steps. But for for the you know it's a it's a blessing in disguise. They do tell you each step as you go along, so you're not always out of the woodworks unless you turn off all of these settings. Then you're doing it hardcore. So, we're going to do normal and get it going. Once again, if you haven't been a part of the stream before, thank you so much for joining. And uh, if you haven't clicked, click subscribe. Let me know in the comments if there's any um, thing that you do know about this level. Is there anything I should know? Any tips? Escape the house. That's a pretty straightforward message right there. can see like right off the bat like they're already like they're already like sprinting and this is the type of game where they're they're constantly spawning like no matter what they're not slowing down for nothing i don't i don't know if you can even do crawlers Oop, my alarm i don't know if you can even make crawlers in this game i think it's just straight um like annihilation essentially so i'm getting out of the basement i haven't even like checked but these are nice little dolls i've i've seen some maps have like 10 to 15 of them and you just go around and you just try to shoot them all no wait is it ads shoot the rest is fine the rest is fine Okay, so it is it is the uh, horizontal. It just doesn't quite match. Okay, so in this mode, it's different like the other levels where you just automatically have power like ready to go. Um, you don't. It doesn't look like they have any setup whatsoever. So, I'm already, like, 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 I don't know, I'm on, a little bit on edge because of uh, <laughs> how this game progresses. Alright, and I gotta go back downstairs. Alright, so it's the switch part, essentially, right? In the right order, right, in the correct sequence. So, which one? 7-3? Is there a seven and a three? Well, obviously finding these switches is important. And some of them are not switches. Some of them are just straight up. Oh, and we have random dogs now, apparently. Alright. 
We'll get it down to like maybe. I mean, I think there's another dog. All right, so we are quite literally locked. We're locked in this house the whole time. All right, and these switches have numbers on them. So I saw seven three, I think. And then I also heard okay three two four. So three two four is what I want. So we got to get up here. I don't know if there's switches are really three two four. Not nah, six, three. So that's one, ah, uh, three, two, four. So we're running it. We're just, we're going for it. Three, two, four. So two is in the middle. Two is in the living room. So three, two. Ah, give me some. Oh, it doesn't give me any money. Where's three? Two's in the living room. Okay. <laughs> Upstairs. Upstairs we go. Three. And this is like such a sketchy scene right here. It's like, what the heck? Just just for the capture. Just for the capture, folks. Just, that's all it's about. That's all it's about here. <laughs> that's such a bad waste of time, but they gave me like enough time to actually do it. All right, three. So three, master bedroom, bottom floor, and then four, right? So master bedroom, living room, and then four. Now I gotta find four. That's probably in an area that I already have an idea of. Holy shoot. I forgot about the ghosties. I'm just ending the round like it doesn't matter, I guess. Oh gosh. Yo, this place is disgusting. Where is four? There, three, two, four. It is. Okay, that's what I'm missing. I didn't even know Thomas was gonna spawn. This is a dog round. Shoot. Dang, I'm getting murked right now. Alright, I need this. I need that. This is just such a small area. Oh my gosh. And I have like zero, um, I don't think I have any, I need that. Oh, that's good. Half off. All right. So if that restores the power, see, I still have to find breakers too. So if it did restore the power, then that's great. But I need ammo, I'll take that. Let's stay up, stay up, stay up. All right, so it's obviously super fast paced. I don't think I restored the power by any means. I may have. If I did, that was super fast. Like, like that was like super fast. If that was the case, restore the gas flow. Yeah, so we're still we're still restoring the gas flow. Thirty-five. So I'm assuming thirty-five is like. Like, what's getting... Oh, it's those.
I didn't realize it said literally like right in the description like the the um the witches. I don't I do not like how high how high I'm progressing, but I don't think I have an option. I think it's just what it is. And this is this weapon right here is one of the newer um weapons they've added to it. I'm super happy about. It's actually a really cool really cool addition. So Oh no. Why did that dude shoot from upstairs? Did you see that? Oh yeah, that's what I need right there, but I also need to stay alive. There is none in there? That is odd. That's very odd to me. So you can't really say, I know my, my screen's blocking off a little bit, but there's only like, it shows like I have a potion, like my equipment, so like, self revive or whatever, heal. I need one more. They're still going down with one hit, which is actually pretty good. But they're trying to make me waste that right there. I know it. They're trying to make me waste my potions. Let's go. Come on. Yo, I just pressed my freaking invincibility, bro. Whatever. So, this is one thing that they didn't, uh... I don't know if I can get a self-revive, even, like, because the power is still not up. Oh, no. Whoops. Oh great. This is this is a uh... I don't know. See, it's so it's so fast paced. You have to hold the zombie like every every round. But also, like, just getting to the point where you can even turn power on. That's that's a whole new step, whole new feature. So shout out to making it even harder than it needs to be. But I will not go to normal mode. But this, unfortunately, probably is going to be the... It's going to be the end. Like, I'm not going to count my lemons here. Even so, there's still Thomas, which he's probably coming down any second. All right, because I didn't beat him. So I don't know where he's running around, but I messed that one up because it already had the lever turned and all right gas lines all right more x's x mark spot there's no handle on that one okay so they're 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 playing a uh, 42 so there's There's multiple places that you have to apparently activate.
took. I gotta remember where I even got the self revive. Cause obviously there's like a gas line and everything. But like, I got three out of five, so. Alright, so there's more X's around the map somewhere. That's my understanding of it. But they're just like sporadic. That one I turned ahead of time. I might have already messed that up. <laughs> Gotta be honest. So, nothing in here. Nothing obvious. Oh, there it is. No, there's not even a handle. So, it's not it. What are you shooting at, bro? Alright, well, I know for a fact that I'm just, like, spending money. Oh, there's another one. But it's nothing. Oh, that was the wrong one to get rid of. Oh, gosh. There it is. So, life tokens upstairs. Master bedroom. Man, there's there's more X's with no knobs on it than there are anything else. I'll tell you, this one's one. That's one. No, really? I'm just gonna hit you, bro. How many other X's could there be that I missed? I didn't really scout downstairs too much because I was like, ah. I'm a scaredy cat. But this is getting a little bit a little bit chaotic. I already did that. I already did that. And then some of them don't even have handles. Like what am I supposed to do about that? Nothing. I'll tell you what I do about that. I do nothing. Oh, They, they both gotta be down there. There cannot just be nothing. Like, there's a button. I'm pressing it. Is there a flashlight? I can't remember. But getting trapped is not the goal. Alright, I don't see any... And if I have to advance around, I'm going to be, <laughs> I'm going to be like, what? Are you serious? Yo, it's like a little, like a little bench area. Well, obviously we have stuff to do. That's very clear. Now, I'll get to know the map, but this is totally the first time I'm ever playing it. I watched a stream from Noah J. And that's that's all I really know. I, I just kind of like took a little took took my time on my day off, watch one of my favorite streamers. <clears throat> but you can't tell me that there's like I like I'm missing one or like does it just not have a handle? Because I've hit, excuse me, I've hit like every X that I see. Like, if it's in the room and I'm not seeing it, please comment where it is located or something. It, it could be upstairs, but, like, I've hit so many of these vowels. Oh, there it is. Dang it. And there's zero time in between. Zero. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> this this may be this may be the end. There's one. It's totally got to be done by round because I feel like that one right there I already like hit. 
Oh no. Oh no. Alright, so now that I know, it would appear that, what the heck, it would appear that, see I need that guy to stay alive, it would just simply appear that, like that valve, I mean I think that that valve just like came to life, so I don't think I passed it. So we're just going to keep going. That valve I don't think had a handle. And I messed that one up, bro. Like, I think I might have glitched it. Because there's got to be one other... One other, um... I keep going left there. And there's nothing in that area. Alright, I can, I can get rid of you. Um, you're a door. Let's go through you. Oh gosh, you're getting fast. Why are you fast all of a sudden, bro? Okay, yo. They don't want me to find <laughs> this gas valve, yo. It is not even fair. Like, I already, that's the last one I did. See, I activated the one down here first before it had the step and it may have just may have just permanently be stuck that way which is my fault it's my fault And like some of these, like I'm like, where is the handle? Like I will take the handle off of you, bro, and I'll put you on a, on something that's gonna work. And I certainly hope that these that that dude in this room here like survives longer than the other guys, cause. I definitely is there is that noise an indication an indication of something there's another one of those I know I have to do something with them um, the wonder weapon once I find it where is it yo you're, you're annoying me brother It doesn't have like a HUD or anything that I know of. I already turned that on. If it's gonna make me go to another round and yo, because that's I think that's the last step that I have to do. It has to be. It's like I'm just trying to get out of the house, bro. I'm sure you can understand if you, if you feel a little cooped up in here. So the gas line, I, I think I bugged it personally. I think I, I think I messed up when I flipped it before getting the step because that's uh. I don't think I'm missing anything, but. Where'd you go? Okay. Well. Let me press this button, please. Dang it. Let's see, what do I got? I mean, it's, it's a healing one, right? That's not bad. Yo. Are you, I just pressed the valve. 
and it didn't even count it. You saw that? I end the round, I go down, I'm going to start back up right where I was, it's ridiculous, but I swear it shouldn't, it shouldn't require, it definitely should not require me to like redo a valve if that's the case, because, because I have already pressed some of these. And I think it is bugged because you saw that I... I think y'all, I think y'all saw me hit that X button and that was like, that was like the fifth one. And it's not my fault that they, uh, may have to patch something here or there. I should have, I should have definitely like, taken like a look at like the notes if they have them. Because there's probably an indication of some sort, like telling me like it's in this room or that room. Like it's one valve, it's this valve. I know, I know it's that valve. <sighs> Great, help. Well, with that being said, I'll, I'll I'll look around one more time, but I'm pretty sure that it's bugged or I've completely missed the mark because none of these other handles have like um none of these other ones have like a uh, like an option to even press. Unless I'm limited to which ones I can touch and stuff. Yo, this is, this is it. GG's chat. GG's. Thomas is coming after me. <laughs> Worse than Thomas is the dogs. Those freaking dogs. Yo. And then I could pack it. Where the heck is this other switch is like my biggest question because if it's not this then I'm, I'm truly wondering like what happened
I mean, if you're in this for content, that's what it's about. I don't know where they're running to. Um. Yeah, that's the bug right there. Because I've tried... Unless I'm missing one, I've tried every, um... I've tried every gas valve there is. So I don't really know. timeout It's like the proof's in the pudding right there. Like I just got an action button to press it and it did nothing. Like like I don't know what else I'm supposed to do, but it's clearly giving me some trouble here. And I've already done I believe I've already done every room that has a part to change, right? So I've already done that. I've already gone through the steps. The question now remains, is it worth continuing? I think it's better for me to get a better insight and maybe practice this map a little bit because I'm getting no like I'm getting nothing right now the stream disconnected kind of figured it was going to it does that sometimes um but we're gonna work on the connectivity issue I don't know if there's a way to really resolve it it's just how it's just how it goes when you don't have your internet hardwired. So, chat, if you're stuck along this wrong, thank you so much for watching. But I think that's essentially the end of this journey. Because this is like... This definitely has a little bit of a issue. A patch. I think it's probably just a patch update. And this, I remember, you gotta you gotta do a bunch of like boss fights and all that jazz. So, you know, it's probably not worth it. So I ran up here, press it, right? I press it again. Unless there's like a specific order and that's like a hidden step. Like I don't know where else it could possibly perceivably be going unless it's leading to each of these empty nozzle empty valves but you know I don't I don't have a powerful gun at this point and it's not resetting the one that I think it's supposed to be it's not resetting this one right here I think I think I but I messed it up straight up So we're gonna I guess this is today literally it's just in the house of the you know of the darn Let's 
Let's go out with a bang. So, that has been a journey. As you can see, I, I more or less understand, like, the premise. It's just really difficult when certain things are not perfected, which it's hard to ask for a perfect game, you know what I mean? Like, like I went down. There's a section of this game where it's actually, uh, it says something about the light. Like, you, you can only access a doorway in death or something like that. But... That's whatever. I know it's you! I forgot, I have like actually pretty decent like perks too. Now this wep- this weapon is what the problem is at this point. Okay. So it's the start of the match. That's the one I need. I need this one right here. It cannot be one of those empty, no-handled, stinking. I'll grab another one. Whatever. It cannot be one of these, and I've I've pressed every one that I'm aware of. Yeah, you said you'd get my get my health back, bro. That's a that's a blatant lie. Let's go down. Ah. ah we're going down. <laughs> the thing is I could just keep going and buying self like revives and stuff like that, but it's not worth it. Ah Watch, there be like a stupid switch down here somewhere. And then I press that, I'm imagining. Like, what was that? Was that just from the pistol? So, as you can see, chat, from what you were able to see while it was live, that is the new map, the new DLC for Screw Ritual, the new zombie killer game. I believe it's going to be a huge hit. I think there's going to be so many people that are excited about this game if it gets to the right audience that they're going to have a very good, very good, um, you know, receptive time from just like the community. There might be some balancing issues that I'm, I, I'm not the like, pro gamer to go like buy like, you know, every detail off of my knowledge is limited as everyone is but i'm here to learn so if you've tuned in if you catch the stream thank you so much once again for joining let's check the comments i don't know if it's gonna let me even refresh with the stream disconnecting but that's okay that's all right we're gonna just do an edit and we're just gonna upload the video so I hope y'all enjoyed. Today was Skur Ritual House of the Dangs. It's a new DLC from I think July 22nd. It was launched. My gameplay, either I'm, I'm missing something that was right in front of my eyes, which if you see it, post in the comments below um, <laughs> what I messed up with. Otherwise, that's a wrap. It's an awesome, awesome game, even on PC. I still I still enjoy using my controller a lot more than the keys. It could be just because I don't have my desk and all the other, you know, things set up quite yet. That might be a part of it. But it does not change the fact that I will be doing my best to bring you content as often as possible. I'm going to be getting back to work a lot more full-time here. And this may be a part of that journey. 
I'm hoping. God willing, it will all work out. Once again, this is Jack Knight. All praise to the Lord God. You know, praise Jesus. That's the reason why I'm here. That's the reason why I came back to stream. So I'm not going to just deny that. No matter, no matter what. So, thank you for joining. Um, thank you for watching. And, of course, if you get a chance, press subscribe. Links are in the description. Let me know if the playthrough had any issues, any critiques and comments, please place them below. And once again, thank you so much and God bless.